Ugh. How we doing, folks? Your buddy Peterbilt down here at Red Tail Outdoors. Well, well, what do we have here? Looks like we ordered ourselves a wallet buckle. Let me tell you. Let me ask. You, let me ask you something, gentlemen. You ever find yourself in a situation where you're wearing a belt buckle? And you're like, man, I hate having to carry this wallet around. Well, you know, some of us don't. Some of us don't. But I saw this. And I thought it would be cool to try it out, right? Because the less things I have in my pockets, the happier I am. I'll tell you that right now. So, we're going to do an unboxing of this bad boy. Let's get in there. Let's get in it. Right now, this company, Wallet Buckle, they're not paying me, is running a special. Um, it's buy one, get one free. Of course, they run that special the day after I order mine. Coincidence? I don't think so. Anyway, um, pretty affordable. I got mine for 25% off using a special code, which is expired now. But now they're running the buy one, get one, which is a better deal. So... You know, WalletBuckle.com if you're interested. But, you know, we haven't even opened it up. So let's see if it's worth the visit. You got the old Watt Knuckler out. Ooh, very sharp still. Let's put it right back here in the deck on the holster, buddy. Get on. Get on. Cool. So, first thing you get is a thank you note. That's cool. There you go. Hope you read that. I did not. Ooh, ooh. Here you go. First thing I noticed, it's nice and big. You know, this is, it said it on there, I'm not surprised, but it said it was printed, not embossed, okay? So we're looking at this belt buckle here, which is friggin' sweet. I like how it's leather with the gold longhorn on it. It's nice and big. I think it'll fit real nice. Of course, of course I'm not wearing a belt right now that would support this belt buckle. There you go, guys. All right, the next thing I noticed about this buckle is it's nice and thick and heavy. Like, this is a nice, heavy belt buckle. I could take it off and beat somebody with it. So it's not one of those shoddy things. Um, real nice. Let's look at the wallet part of it. All right, so there's the buckle part. Real nice, just hook and lasp, just like any other belt buckle. Right, you slide your belt through there, loop it over, bolt tight. Put that in the hole. Let's get a card and see how it fits in there. It looks like it would fit pretty good because it's, you know, let's see how many cards it can hold. Let's see how little cards it can hold. Let's see if we can put one in there and if it would stay. Let me go get some. All right, got one. We're going to use an old, old license. Let's see if it'll hold one piece in there. Um, you know, securely. So here it is. Now what you do is you take this, slide it right in the back there. Whoop. Right in the back. Wow. All right, so, yeah, I don't think that's gonna go anywhere. Don't look. I don't think that's gonna go anywhere. Even one. So you could just put your ID in here and be good, or your debit card. Okay, so there's one card. Let's put another one in there. Okay, credit card. Yeah, feels real good. There you go. If I wanted to get this out, guys, I would have to try to get it out. You know, it's not just going to fall out of there. That's cool. You got to really get it out of there. And I don't think it'll be too bad even if it was on a belt. Because the belt will stick it out like that. So you still have room to get your thumb in there to get that out. Let's see if you can hold three. Don't know why you'd be carrying around more than just a debit card and your ID, but some people like to be fancy. So This is three cards. It says it holds up to four securely. Now, one card fits secure. The more you put in there, I think it'll fit more secure because you're getting that back pressure on there. Right, so that's three cards. 
You see how this is bent? I'm guessing that is what's keeping it in there. Okay, so you put a straight cord in there, it's going to push it, it's going to get lodged in there. Cool. Mm. All right, it's a little tougher to get out the more cards you have in there as well. One, two, and a license. One card in there, it's not going to fall out. I can't get it to fly out of there, so. Good deal. Only thing I'm kind of concerned with this is how long this is going to last, you know? It's like a printing on there, so. I don't know how long that that's going to last. All right, that's what I'm talking about right there, guys. So this is like, I don't know. If I took something sharp and rubbed it against it, I bet it would come off. It seems like it's on there fine right now. But if you, you know, I'm always rubbing my belt buckle into things. Um, Side of tables or countertops. We'll do it until it rubs off, and then I'll let you know. There you go. Wallet buckle. I think it'll be all right for the money. Let's put it on a belt and see what it looks like. Sorry, folks, for the uh, shot here, but it is a belt buckle video, so... So, for any of you who have never put a belt buckle on, you got to get a belt that has the snaps, right, that will allow you to have a belt buckle on there. You put this around that. See, slide that in the front. In the back, you snap it. Okay. Then you put this right through there. You put the other end of your belt right through the loop. Then this little notch here, little notch, let me get a white background right there. There. You put in one of these little holes. Whatever one is comfortable. There you go. So that is what this one looks like. Jig around there. Okay, so it looks good. Especially if I had some jeans on or something, I just got these old work pants on right now. So. Looks good. Now if I wanted to put something in there, what side does it go in? Left side, okay. Hold up. One card fits perfectly. How you gonna pay, cash or credit? Well ma'am, I think today we're gonna do, we're gonna do credit here. Just stick it on this card here. Thanks so much. You know, you gotta get the angle to get it back in there, which might be the trickiest thing. But there you go. Got everything you need right in your belt buckle. No uh, messing up your pocket lines with the wallet. Good to go. Cool. Mm. Kind of weird video considering the placement of the buckle. Check that bad boy out. That's what I'm talking about. So, I'd recommend it. I'll come back after I've used it a little bit. This was just an unboxing and initial review. Um, there you go. I'm happy with it. I'd like to see how it looks with something that I'd normally wear a belt buckle with and not a work belt. If you like the video, subscribe. Tell your friends, make them subscribe. And we'll catch you in the next video. Peace.